If you think, you are not attracted to God, then this is ignorance. God is universal magnetism. Maharishi Vetha Theory Suggestion If you watch this video till end, the content will blow your mind definitely. Disclaimer, my only wish, is to attach myself, in lotus feet of my spiritual master. Oh master please give me mercy, may I sing your glories throughout three world. Have you wondered how planets are perfectly placed from sun where science fails to understand its reason? Have you ever wondered why after the death of person, his body is kept facing north-south? Have you ever wondered why it is said to donate anything using right hand? Sit down with us, we will tell you everything, we will try to, keep it short, watch it till end, to understand it complete science behind it. Wasting no time, today we will reveal, some, Maharishi Beth Athiri secrets. We are sure, no YouTube channel, has bought these, revelations so far, for you. Welcome to Back to Godhead TV. No introduction is needed, for Maharishi Beth Athiri words, speaks his glories. In the beginning of the universe, Brahma, Vishu, Mahesh appeared. Where Brahma is the engineer? Vishu is the maintainer, and, Shiva is the destroyer. Be blessed by the Divine. Where Vishnu, at his will can increase, his size comma equal of entire universe, or can shrink his size, of an atom. No this one is important to listen carefully. From your clothes, to your desk, every bit, of matter, is made of, tiny particles, called atoms. Atoms have negatively charged electrons that spin around them. Most of the time, the electrons spin in random directions. <gasps> it actually stared with a black hole. According to Einstein's relativity, a black hole is a region of space-time where gravity has become so strong that nothing can escape. When in an atom, electrons rotate, in same manner, from their static state, due to comprehensive forces, due to repulsion, in them, the rotation causes, the generation of the, magnetic field. When something is magnetic, it can keep the things together, either here or in the universe. Heat and spin, keeps the Earth's, outer surface moving. This movement causes, electrical currents in the core of Earth which is mostly iron. Sun also have a large amount of iron due to fission of helium in it, which can't be further fused by fission. That's how Sun emits magnetic fields to all planetary system. The magnetic fields are tilted slightly from the Earth's axis. Sometimes the magnetic field is stronger than at other times. Sometimes, the magnetic field's alignment moves from the Earth's spin axis. The planetary system stays perfectly tight to Sun due to Sun's increased magnetic universal fields in space. The magnetic force that extends into space, this force acts like a shield protecting the Earth from harmful gases and charged particles, that would destroy the atmosphere. Both Earth's, inner and outer core are metal, but, the outer core remains liquid, while, pressure keeps the, inner core solid. The liquid, outer core is constantly moving. These magnetic fields, also surrounds the Earth's outer surface, giving it protection from, harmful rays of sun. This magnetic fields also form ozone layer inside the Earth, to prevent radiation. But why death body is placed in North and South? 
because magnetic fields emerges from North Pole to South Pole, the matter of body can perfectly taken away by its magnetic fields. That's why North is called this place of Yamra and Shastra. Magnetism has given us electricity, radio, television, computers, and thousands of other things, but its greatest gift to mankind is yet to be realized. Robert Adams discovered that huge amounts of heat could be generated by the magnetic field in what he called his thermomotor. God is universal magnetism, all attracted. I am sure that in due course, this philosophy will be introduced in the educational curriculum to the adolescent students for development of their personalities to be good citizens of the universe. The earth is one and the sea is one, although they seem to be severed by the intervention of one another. Humanity is one, and the goal of all is the same. Everyone is born, lives and dies at a certain time. During the period of living, one should understand the value of oneness with life. Maharishi Veta theory, quantum mechanics, reveals itself at the subatomic scale, where we are dealing with just a few elementary particles, while gravity becomes noticeable only when we collect astronomically large masses is as large planetary masses. Maharishi Veta Theory I will reveal you its secret from Bible, in future, only back to Godhead TV. If you like it, do subscribe no, subscribe button is down. We will keep bringing great videos like this. To Bible, to Raw. Bhagavad Gita and Guru Granth Sahib Ji, we will cover the universe with you here. Further Srimad Bhagavatam states, Srimad Bhagavatam 1.10 04 All their hearts were melting for him on the pot of attraction. They looked at him without blinking their eyes, and they moved hither and thither in perplexity. Krishna is naturally attractive for all living beings because he is the chief eternal amongst all eternals. He himself, showing his supreme form, in the Bhagavad Gita, says. Bhagavad Gita 14.4- It should be understood that all species of life, O son of Kunti, are made possible by birth in this material nature, and that I am the seed-giving father. So on who is pious soul can attain God-realization, but fallen, and degraded soul, they are also so-called Asuras can never understand the importance of monistic Vedanta. Maharishi said, Man has to understand the value of himself, the purpose of birth and has to develop his consciousness to fulfill the purpose, by Maharishi Veta theory. Maharishi explained it all in simple words. That's all, so we discussed everything on this topic, I don't think, more is required to discuss, than, these proofs and facts. It should be understood that Krishna, the very name, suggests attractive. Krishna means all attractive. He has got, because he is complete, poor Anna, so he has got all the attractive features, from material point of view comma the spiritual point of view. If still not understood, then we will further come with more proofs, facts and figure. Stay tuned, we will be reveling truth from Bible, Quran, Guru Granth Sahib, about God, only on Back to Godhead TV. Please share these videos to them, many need it. I request you, to share and pass it. Come, join our mission please. It just take a second to share and subscribe that give motivation, and hope in me, to serve you, in a better way. Be blessed by the Divine. We will come back again tomorrow on Back to Godhead TV only for you with again something new. Hope you subscribe us.
There is no problem in the nature, only the problem is in the mind. The principal goals of introspection are examining yourself and finding out what you are. By Maharishi Vetha Theory Are you on Insta? Bless us on Instagram, at Bakdog.